Hey everyone, Tim here. Gigwise, whatever you want to call me. Got this wagon that I've been looking at at Costco. It was $89.99. I said I'd go back and find it on sale shortly. That was two weeks ago. Well, I picked it up two days ago for $20 less. $69.99 right now at Costco. I don't know the expiration date on that, but it just started within the last two weeks, so hopefully it doesn't go long. But I'm going to see what we have here because I need the new one for the catering order since I left that one at a, at a drop off out back by their dumpster so somebody took it but hopefully I don't have to put much together because I've got a catering order to go yeah I have got to leave for for like 20, 20 minutes don't need those hey we can do Asmir I'm also using that lapel mic that I just did a video on Asmir, is that what they do? ASMR? Wait. Ridges. <laughs> I don't get the popularity of these Asmir videos. Do you hear that sliding out? <laughs> This is way, way better quality, let me tell you, than the one I bought off Amazon last week. And it looks fairly put together. Oh, I'm trying to get this in here. This is how it came out. It's got some weight to it, and it's on wheels, so it doesn't want to stay up. Let me see if I can sit it on its side, and that'll hold it there so I can cut this, cut this tape and get the, the foam off of it. I was hoping it'd be fairly put together. Some of them you got to put... Oh, shoot. Asmir got that. <laughs> that was nice and loud. Uh, these are plastic, but they kind of have a rubber feel. So they won't just slide really easy sideways. Um, yeah, some of them you got to put the wheels on, the handles, like that, that little crappy one I bought off of Amazon. I had to do all that with it. Get that out of my way. And you should be able to just pop this up. Oh, it's got some foam on the handle. I'll get rid of that. It's got some Velcro here on the handle to hold it together. That's good. Wow, they really went overkill. It's also got a one of these little clippy dealies. Pop that. Turn it this way so you can see it. And it should just... Oh, yeah. This is way, way better, way bigger than the Amazon one, which I'll show you in just a moment. That Amazon one. Let me tilt this a little this way. Cut all the stuff I don't need off, all the Chinese stuff. I say that because I'm looking at directions here and half of them are in Chinese. Then Korean, Japanese, a couple different dialects of Chinese, maybe Cantonese, uh, classic Chinese, simplified Chinese, I don't know. A lot of different languages. Get that off. Put that out of the way. It's going right in the dumpster. Oh, come on. Is that really sticking out of the bottom? The little plastic tabs. It's somewhere. I can't find where it's coming through. Well, I'll cut it on this side and just lose it along the way somewhere. I got to remember I have this lapel mic on so I don't have to yell at the camera all the time. Oh, there it is. It's on the top side here. Okay, get that out of there. This goes with the trash. Um, one of those moisture absorbers. I got a place to put that. In that drawer right there where I keep the lighter for my barbecue pit. This has it built in. Uh, my old one had, the one I lost, had a something that unfolded you put in the bottom. But you could not fold it up with that. So I was constantly taking it out, putting it in, taking it out. In fact, I still have it because I didn't use it in the wagon that day. Didn't have to. Just added some more support. And so far, this seems like a pretty doggone good quality wagon for um, $69.99 plus tax, whatever your local sales tax is. Let me get around here. It's got a, a lever. Um, not sure how the lever works. We will figure this out because I have to use this shortly. 
Oh, I see. You flip it this way, that lets you pull it up and go back. But this should... Okay, you got to tug it a little harder than I thought. This should pop out. What's the... Oh, here we go. There's a button. I like that. Yeah, this is way, way better quality than the one I bought at Walmart that I left on a delivery. And it just, okay, so it clips in like that. See this other one I've got? It's so short. If I got to stack bags on top, when I put the handle back up, it knocks the dang bags back and knocks the back one off onto the ground. We can't have that. That's people's, that's customer's food. And that happened to me yesterday. So I said, I will get this put together and shoot a video today. I don't, I don't even know if I locked this. No, I didn't. Okay, we're going to fold this one back up. It should just be a quick boom, boom. Oh, pull the little, the rip cord in the middle here. And we good to go to keep it from unfolding while I'm traveling down the road. We just, you can either clip that or you can actually use the handle and Velcro it. I like that clip a lot better. We'll tuck this right in the back of, I forgot it's on wheels. I just showed you something not to do, but let me tilt this over towards Clifford and make sure. Got you in the camera there. Sorry for the vibrations. Tilt you up a little bit, get more of the full view. Yeah, if you go get yourself one of these, <laughs> remember, when it's in folded up mode, it's on wheels. It won't stand up. <laughs> it does take up quite a lot more space than my old wagon. And a lot more space than this one. But this one stays up on its own. That's a, That's got it going for it. But... I'll fix that better with the bungee once I get everything set up. Get these catering bags out of the way. I just did a catering order uh, 6 15 a.m. this morning. Yeah, this is the this is the the one I got. It's good for your kids to take stuff to the beach or the park. It's fine for that. But these wheels are the wheels are tiny on it this handle here's what i'm talking about i get i can barely get one in the bottom it, it fits it real snug and then uh since i take bigger orders you gotta i stack bags on top of it like this and they overlap it they're they're my uh, this this one and my old one i had room to spare at each end on the by on, on the wagon so they stayed securely on there I stack one on top, and that way, just like Jenga, keeps it under. But this one, as I'm, I got a pause. Oh, I'm used to my old one. The handle was much longer. It's another thing. The handle's short on here, and when you're tugging it behind you, it keeps the wheels keep hitting the heels of your shoes, trying to rip your shoes off. But this one, I there, you just saw it. Well, when this back bag's got food in it, and that little bump, it just knock it right off. There goes customer's food. We can't have that. This new one. Is going to be awesome, babies. This one's going back up. This one's going to go up front by my... I've got a cart up there, too. It's a dolly that breaks down to a flatbed cart. And uh, I can put that back to a dolly and put that back inside and keep it out of my van. Because I don't want to lose that. i got to use that for moving stuff around here. Or if I get some big orders uh, from Lowe's or something, I'll, i got my little dolly here. But that one's more heavy duty. But that's the new wagon again right there's what it looks like you can get this at costco right now for 69.99 plus whatever your local sales tax is it holds up to a 350 pound limit and it that's what my old one did but this one is way better quality than my old one by far i mean it, it's just really rigid feeling compared to that one and that handles way better and the wheels are bigger but great deal guys and uh may go on clearance it may go down lower than 69.99 right uh like it is right now but still if you look them up on amazon uh 
that cost me $60. That piece of junk cost me $60 on Amazon. And like I said, it may get, be good for kids to tote around the park, the beach or whatever, but for I'm using it for business and I gotta, I gotta have dependable stuff. And that is not that the new one. Heck yeah. I give it a, I give it a big thumbs up and I'm going to give it a test drive here in just about an hour and 10 minutes. So, so far so good on it. I'm, I'm happy. And now I got something good to work with again. And it tucks out of the way, as you see. Till next time, guys. That's my second review now. Thanks, Dash and Grandpa, for giving me that motivation. We'll see you next time, guys. <laughs>